Hello everyone and welcome to Monday. Something arrived in the mail today, but before I show it, I need to give some context. I have been using disposable razors ever since I could shave. Um, when I first started to shave, my mom had given me uh, this like entire like shaving kit with all the stuff that you need to do it, and I used the shaving cream once, and I was like, I don't like this. And from that day forward, I never used shaving cream again. I've always used just a disposable razor with water, sometimes not, on my face. Some of you are cringing right now, and I understand. Um, I don't get razor burn. I don't know why. I have no idea why. But ever since I've been old enough to shave, I've been shaving with a disposable razor used way too long. I mean, like, like six to nine months. Again, some of you are, like, dying. I, I don't get razor burn, so I, I don't know. Um, and that's just the way it's always been. Um, in fact, I, my mom one Christmas bought me a pack of like 12 uh, disposable razors, and they lasted me like five years. And I know that this all sounds crazy, but uh, it's leading up to what this is about today. Um, I've been using disposable razors forever, and I've never had a problem with them. Again, I never had any issues with razor burn. I never had any issues with cutting myself. But recently, I ran out of those disposable razors that I've been using forever. And I got a new set of disposable razors because I needed some more. And ever since I got this new set, I've been cutting myself. And about a week ago, I cut myself pretty bad. And I was like, these razors suck. And I've been told for years that I would just benefit from having an electric razor um, because I, I don't have to use shaving cream because I won't. I know myself. I won't. I just hate everything about it. It reminds me of whipped cream, which I also hate, and I'm just not going to use it. So I decided since the disposable razors are starting to cut me and I can't find the, the kind that I had been using, I guess they stopped making them, I needed to just get an electric razor. Now, I don't know anything about this. Mallory is kind of my expert when it comes to, I need to buy something, please tell me what to buy. As a heads up, or not a heads up, as an aside, the razors Steven used were like the ones that come in a bag, the whole cheap, cheap razors, not like the ones with the cartridges. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, oh yeah, I guess, yeah, they were really- There's a step between okay. what you were using and- yeah, yeah, it, yeah, I really, yeah, people need to understand, like, the razors I used, like, I would, it would be like a dollar <laughs> for a razor, and you would be intended to use that, I think, for like a week, and I would use it for like six months, but I never had any problems, you know, like, I never hurt, um, you know, I never cut myself, but I had been using a very specific kind of disposable razor, and eventually, they just don't make them or something now, so... Instead of continually trying brands and cutting myself, because um, again, I yeah, I cut myself pretty bad. There's a lot of blood. Um, I told Mal to just find me something because she's the expert at finding. So Merry things. Christmas. Thanks. So this <laughs> uh, this came today. This is the uh, I don't know what this is. This is a Bronze Series Eight. Bronze Series Eight, and it's got all sorts of things in it. And I've never had an electric razor. I've never even had a nice normal razor. Because yeah. I've only ever had the, the like Mouse says, the bag -o razors, and that was fine. That was fine. So I'm going, I'm kind of jumping the step. I, I've never had the ones with the replaceable cartridges, so I'm, I'm just skipping that and going straight to this. Because this, you don't need the shaving cream. You just charge it, and you just go zip, 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 and then you're done. And this one actually um, has a cleaning thing with it where you dock it, and it cleans it. Because we all know you're not going to bother to take it apart and do it yourself. Basically that. That's one of the reasons I use the disposable ones anyway. My idea of cleaning was when I was done shaving, I would beat it against the sink and then I would dry it off and I would sit it down. And I, that's how I got many, many months out of a cheap, cheap razor. But uh, those days are behind me. I guess I become an adult today. Took me a while, but I got there. Um, and I'm gonna charge this thing. I need to shave anyway, so I'm gonna give it a shot. And uh, we got this from Costco. Costco had this on uh, on it was sale. On sale, really good. Well, Costco does it a lot where they have yeah. things that are like good 
and then very on sale. So we decided that this would be the one to that I'll try. So we'll charge it up and then uh, I'll give it a shot. Also, I'm not an unboxing channel, but I figured I'd at least show what was in the box. Uh, first thing, the box I just showed, this big one, unnecessarily big because inside is just a smaller box that has all of the stuff in it. Why I'm they, so mad. What, I don't know what the purpose of that is. Anyway, you get the razor, uh, I'd hope so, um, a travel case, power, uh, whatever this is. What is this? A little brushy boy. That's to clean it. If something gets stuck. Sure. I'm, I'm, so, I'm not familiar with the concept of cleaning a razor. I'm, I'm familiar with the concept of beating it and then after some amount of time going, eh, it's probably use a new one. Here's a little cartridge. So this keeps it clean. So the idea is that like if you keep it in good shape, it'll last longer. And honestly, I don't shave every day anyway. I shave only like usually like twice a week or so because I don't mind having a, a little bit because I'm like, I don't, who cares? I don't care. So um, it'll probably last a long time anyway. And then uh, this is the little docking bay thing. Okay, now I'll hook it up. All right, so this thing is charged and um, I have literally never in my life used one of these because I've never been in a position to do so. I understand how it works. You hold it on your face and move it and it cuts the hair for you. But this is, um, this is a new experience. That had more power behind it than I was expecting. My God. It's so loud. Jesus, okay, I, all right, so this will cut, should I wet it? Should I, do you wet these? I, don't, I think you do. Wet, turn it on. It's so loud. Oh my goodness, it cuts the hair off my face. Oh, that's neat, look at that. Oh, neat, look at that, the hair just comes off. This is probably funny because, like, I'm, like, discovering this. And then I just, like, rinse it out. Like that, maybe. Oh, probably. See, I'm so used to just whacking it against the sink, which I guess I'm not supposed to do now that this is, like, a piece of equipment. Um. Huh! And it, like, doesn't cut me. That's amazing. What will they think of next? All right, so uh, when I'm done, I just, I think I just put it in this, and then it, it shows that it's good. And then if I want to clean it, there's a button I hit and it like cleans it for me. Neat. Um, it took longer. I mean, I've never used one of these before, so maybe that's why. It took longer, and it definitely, like, I did it, and I was like, cool. And then I felt my face, and I was like, oh, <laughs> there's a lot of hair still there. So I had to, like, figure out how to do it at the right angle. But I eventually did get it. So it's not, it, ultimately, it ended up being as close as the other razor. Maybe closer, especially because the razor I was using, like, you know, it gets dull after a week. And then I just kept using it. So this is probably giving me a better shave, but it does take longer. Um, but I'm not worried about cutting myself. Like even when I was using the other ones, I was at least like kind of careful. With this, I wasn't careful at all. I was just like, duh, 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 duh. and it seems like it's fine. Neat. Okay. Well, it's probably gonna take a while to uh, to get used to this, but I will in time. Anyway, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, we'll see you back tomorrow, shall we?